Alberta is believed to be sitting atop 1.8 trillion barrels of oil, but the vast majority of it is so deep it can't be reached with today's technology, shrinking Canada's proven oil reserves to 168 billion barrels. Still, that's third largest in the world. Only Venezuela and Saudi Arabia are sitting on more black gold. So with more than 90% of Canada's oil already written off, there are still barriers to getting at the rest. First is cost. To get a new oil sands operation up and running, a barrel of oil needs to be selling for about $100. Below that, it's not worth the money to start digging. And then there is location. Alberta is landlocked, so getting the oil to refineries and markets cost extra, about $10 a barrel more, further cutting into profits. And finally, time seems to be running out for crude. Saudi Arabia's powerful oil minister recently predicted the end of fossil fuels by 2040 or 2050 and said his country is starting to focus on developing solar power. G7 leaders, including Canada's Stephen Harper, recently pledged to decarbonize the global economy by the end of this century, meaning for one reason or another, it's quite likely a lot of the oil sands will stay in the ground. Yeah.